It looks just like the radar images you'd see your local TV meteorologist use, and that's by design. But this product is called Offshore Precipitation Capability, OPC, and it shows precipitation in areas where you couldn't see it before. We don't have uh, radar offshore. It doesn't reach far enough into the ocean to see basically. So we have to come up with another method to depict where thunderstorms and precipitation is. OPC is almost as accurate as NEXRAD radar that we're used to seeing with more than 90 percent accuracy. Here's how it works. OPC basically takes uh, satellite data, model data, lightning data, and merges that together into a radar-like depiction. For a good real-world example of OPC in action, you need only go as far back as Hurricane Maria, which demolished Puerto Rico's radar tower in September 2017. After that, the uh, National Weather Service approached us because they knew we had this capability and asked if we could give them access so that they would at least have some kind of coverage over the island and the adjacent waters. This loop shows some radar data over Florida and South Texas but the rest is OPC. Radar activity over Florida and off the uh, adjacent waters into the Gulf of Mexico is uh, actual radar data. The rest of this is OPC generated. Uh, the hurricane itself, uh, you can see even the uh, uh, well-defined eye shows up very well on OPC. Uh, this uh, cold front that has moved off the east coast is from uh, OPC. And uh, Finally, the activity moving into uh, uh, Mexico is also OPC generated. The next step will be for operators, air traffic controllers, planners, to learn how to use this new technology that never existed before, but will be an important tool for the future.